A big development tonight in the search for a South Carolina man wanted in a multi-state crime spree that includes the killing of two people here in St. Louis County. Police spotted him in a wooded area of South Carolina. 70-year-old Barbara Goodkin was killed as she and her husband drove in University City. Her husband was wounded and Sergei Zakharov, 58, a doctor, killed in Brentwood as he waited for an Uber ride. Those killings an hour apart. Reporter Jamal Goss has the latest for us tonight from Chester County, South Carolina. Tonight, officials in Chester County say they're closer to putting Tyler Terry behind bars. An officer spotted him in the woods earlier today. Meantime, the search for an accused killer continues. Officials in Chester County are blocking several streets near Highway 9 while authorities search for Tyler Terry. Gloria Walls and her family were inside one of several cars that had to be turned around. They need to go ahead and get him off the streets with all the harms that he's done to the families. For the last six days, Tyler has been on the run. Authorities have linked him to at least four murders and say he shot at Chester County deputies last week during a high speed chase. His girlfriend, Adrian Simpson, was arrested when they crashed. She's facing charges, including accessory after the fact. Officials spotted Terry near Ligon Road close to Mount Ararat AME Zion Church and say he led them on a foot chase through a thick wooded area. It's definitely easy for somebody to make a few moves and slip away or uh, try to hide. But you know, we got a lot of people out here. And Grant Suskin with the Chester County Sheriff's Office says more than 100 local and federal agents have been working around the clock. Right now, authorities want people who live near Old Richburg Road to be on the lookout for anything suspicious. They're reminding people to lock their doors and remove any firearms from their vehicle. Meantime, Walls says she's shocked that something like this is happening so close to home. You got to be careful who you trust in this world. Yeah, but especially her age. Because the Adrian, she used to babysit my children, and I would have never thought she would have done something like this. Never would have thought. Yeah, she that's just, that's just like terrible, this. terrible, terrible. And Walz's husband, who you saw sitting in the passenger seat, says he's related to Eugene Simpson. Authorities found his body in a ditch late Thursday and are accusing Terry of killing him. Meantime, officials have set up a perimeter and are using tracking teams and dogs to continue their search. In Chester County, I'm Jamal Goss. Back to you.